surprising announcement is shaking things up in the race for governor. A major Collier supporter is breaking with Republicans and supporting independent Greg Orman. KSNT News Capitol Bureau reporter Hannah Brandt tells us what it means for the campaign. It came as a shock to some, but as the former president of the Kansas Farm Bureau and the farmer of this soybean field, Steve Backus says he believes Orman is the best choice for Kansas farmers. Steve Backus was a chairman with the Collier campaign. And when Collier lost the Republican primary and endorsed Chris Kobach, Backus decided to break with his party. I'm a Republican as well, but I do not support the platform that Chris Kobach is running on. I don't think it's good for the state of Kansas in a lot of different ways that I'm not going to go into, but I do think the platform that Greg Orman is running on is excellent for the state of Kansas. It's forward thinking, it's progressive, and it's just exactly what we need at this point in time. He says Orman appeals to him because of his plans for the state's farmers. Greg Orman understands the state of Kansas. He understands business. He understands how to create and grow businesses. Make no mistake about it, farming in today's world is a business. If anyone farms and thinks it's not a business, they're not going to farm for long. We reached out to Kobach for his reaction. He says, It's no surprise that Topeka insiders are sticking together. Our campaign to fight special interests, bring good paying jobs to hardworking Kansans, and fix Topeka is not going to be popular with the special interest crowd, and I'm okay with that. But Orman says he's honored by Bacchus's decision to join his campaign, and says it's a reflection of what he has to offer farmers and conservatives. Chris operates in sort of a fact-free zone. The fact of the matter is, you know, Steve has been farming in Kansas for over 40 years. He's a Kansan and a farmer first and foremost. And, and ultimately, uh, I think what, what Steve is saying is, is sending a signal to all Republicans everywhere uh, that the Orman Dahl campaign is, is a campaign that has something for you and, and that you should vote for. Governor Collier also reacted to the announcement. He says he didn't know the former chairman was planning to join Orman until this morning when it happened. And the governor doubled down on his own endorsement of Secretary Kobach. In Minneapolis, Hannah Brandt, KSNT News. Hi, in addition to Orman and Kobach, Laura Kelly also running as a Democrat in that race. Orman and Bacchus were campaigning together tonight. They were in Beloit to speak with the Kansas Farm Bureau.